Mike's right here on the Elite Western course and hanging out with some of my good friends shooting out here and I'd jump on and talk a little bit about what the Western course entails. So the Elite Western course is designed to take you out and put you in 20 different hunting scenarios. Real life opportunities, uncomfortable opportunities, just things that we've encountered as hunters, me, Garrett, Maurice, my crew, uh, to help share the success, the strife, the misses, the close calls, and share those shots that we've had in our experience and lay them in a course for you to try to work. And it really details the second axis, third axis, and just total concentration and waiting for that right opportunity. down there at 91 yards um, and there's two branches out of the pine tree that come over basically block from its neck down to its belly button which is your shot basically and so but there's a flight window above it that's actually there now so I shot it for what I think is 90 I'm still sighting in for that so um, I caught a, you could hear a couple little ticks through the brushes of the pine needles but I still found them Block shots, screen shots, arcing opportunities you got to pay attention to, knowing your equipment, the flight of your arrow. course is to really help you evaluate your equipment and you as a shooter 
in the woods and the mountains on real hunting shot opportunities. So we encourage you to come out, bring your gear, bring your glass, bring your hunting clothes, bring what you're going to wear to hunt. Make sure it all, you know, jives together, right? Make sure it all works. And we're just here to help you be a better hunter, a better archer, no matter your skill, your ability, or your discipline. Come check out Mountain Archery Fest in the Elite Western Course. I was climbing this razor. You know what I mean? It was like this wide of razor rock. And it was like 800 feet this way, 300 feet this way. Dude. And it's like, I got to a point where even I got to a point where I was like, I'm going back. And like, when I looked back, and I was like, nope, I'm not going back. It's a point of Yeah, yeah I have to continue to go forward because backwards was not going to happen. <laughs> What's going on, bro? What's up, dude? Got your camera. Ha ha ha. That's why you don't this is why I don't pass off the camera and you get stuck. Dude, we better top off our water because this after the elk, dude, the climb is stupid. <laughs> Miss the beaver <laughs> at Beaver, Utah.
gonna miss a coos deer. He turns broadside, 51 yards. A draw. I'm shaking like a leaf on a tree. He's a monster big buck. I can't hold it together. I can't even do it. And I missed. But that time, I killed him. Because this was an actual scenario that I was in in August last year on my first coos deer hunt. And we put my miss on this course for you to practice so it doesn't happen to you. And that's the reality of the elite western course. I think I smoked that deer this time. <laughs>